Hey guys, um, welcome back to another part of uh, Pokemaniac Tech's Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. And in the last part, um, I'm sorry I couldn't include my last uh, part three, but um, but because uh, my file accidentally got corrupted and, and it got um, uh, somehow got deleted. So yeah. So um, but in the last part, all we did is that we just took care of the trainers. Um, my I named my rival Paul um, after one of those uh, after one of Ash's rivals from the anime because you know his attitude is like Paul's. You know, he's he he's stuck up. He's rude. Only cares about strong Pokemon and this and that. So if if you guys think Paul is a good name, sure you can comment it. And if you guys think that it's a bad name, don't comment. Cause uh, that's his that that's his name. Oh yeah, by the way, um, I got a new Pokemon, um, a Bellspur, and I nicknamed him Power Plant because obviously, you know, it, it's time to start using the power of Grass type moves. And and, and this guy here, he has a he, he wants a Bellspur, and, and he's gonna trade. He's, he he'll give you a Pokemon that has a disadvantage against a Bellspur, and that's an Onix. Well, it's good if you're going against the first gym leader because he uses Rock types, and obviously, Rock is good against Flying, but. Other than that, I don't like Onyxes very much. So this guy, he spins around for a while and says, uh, Battle Gym Leader when you did. And yeah, he did this guy has one of the worst English I can ever, I can ever imagine. But he, he's actually the teacher of this school, which is called, if you guys saw Earl Pokemon Academy. I'm not sure, yeah. And he just spins around before he goes into his gym. Don't know why, though. Well, anyway, um... So what else is there to do here? Um, I, I guess we might as well take care of the trainers in this place here, which is known as the Sprout Tower. Experience the way of Pokemon, yeah. And this is actually a place that's known for training, and if you guys see, yeah, um, they're talking about how the legend of how Sprout Tower came to be is that a 100 foot tall bell sprout um, um, created the center of the tower, making it stand still. Yep, it's a place of Pokemon training, and you see now that it's a home to all these monks here who like to battle. So let's, uh, yeah, the battle will remain, the tower will remain hard and strong. Alright, just took care of that. That actually was a quite a long battle because I just wanted to train up my Bellsprout power plant. So yeah, got a paralyze here. Um, will be quite helpful. So we're just gonna head on and battle this next dude here. We stand guard this tower. Here we experience a gratitude to all Pokemon. That's what I want to hear. Thank you. Y y you're glad that you lost? <laughs> eh? I would have to say it's kind of stupid, and because I mean, who 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 who's who who is thanking me for losing? Anyway, I got got an XQC. Probably won't be needing it later. We'll see. So let's see. Who's this dude? Sway like leaves in the wind. That sounds like sleep talk to me. Alright, we defeated that guy, and uh, okay. I forgot to get that item. You trained to find enlightenment in Pokemon. Good for you. So, anyway, we're up against Sage Jin here, um, who has another bell spread. Um, might as well do a little training for my, um, power plan. Uh, um, you know, I, I think, I think I can, I'll just switch out and go into Hot Tamale just, just to get some experience and save some time here. Yeah, Hot Tamale has two levels of evolving, but yeah, with Ember. Okay. And it gets 54. Your training is incomplete. Well, I guess you need to train harder, man. Oh yeah, so I wonder what that is. Oh, it's another potion. Okay. Pretty convenient. Um, yeah, I'll just battle this guy over here. The Elder's HM even lets the pitch black darkness. Ah, well, that's pretty cool. And who's this guy? Sage Neil. That is actually Bloody Biscuit's first name. Oh no, I remember he even mentioned, he, he even admitted that his first name was actually Neil. Too bad there isn't a sh- I, I wonder why, I wonder where, where you can find him. A, a trainer around here whose name is Sean, because that Sean is actually my- th that's actually my actual name, in case you're wondering. So, yeah, Bellspot goes for the fight, it does absolutely nothing, um, uh, yeah, Emperor. Okay, that was me taking a drink there. 
is having some tea with me. So Sage Neil is defeated. It's your head that is bright. Yep, so is mine. So who's this? Let's see how let me see how much I trust the Pokemon. Well I trust my Pokemon very much. We're a team. Sage Troy. And he has another bell sprout. And he goes for growth. <laughs> I don't think that's ever gonna help you because obviously you don't you stand no chance against my heart in LA. Especially with Ember and, and even with Divine Move. I think it's like a physical move or something, so it, it doesn't do any good for him. And okay, level 13. Just one more level and it'll do. And what do you have? Oh you got a hoot hoot. Oh this is something new. Uh, let's see, I, I, might, I might as well switch out into into power plant, but I'm gonna switch back into hot tamale just for the experience. So yeah. Uh yeah, yeah. what's he gonna do now? Oh he's gonna use force sight. Well <laughs> It's gonna do no good because I I'm not a ghost type and well yeah and what foresight does is that it identifies the Pokemon so um what it does is that it lets the um your Pokemon use um a, a normal and fighting types against a ghost Pokemon because as you know they're completely immune to it so in in a ways it can be helpful but not really okay so I got some more experience sweet Sage Troy's defeated yes your trust is real. Yes, there are people who care about me. And what's next? Um, and an earthquake. Just kidding. And hey, it's Paul. Yeah, and he just actually defeated this um monk dude. Um, and yeah, he says that you should treat your Pokemon better. Yep, that's exactly right. Yeah, the, the way he was. Yep, Pokemon are not tools of war, man. That is the key to battling. But you don't know it. Oh, he claims to be the elder, but he's weak. Okay. And he never loses to fools that babble about being nice to Pokemon. Well, you really couldn't care about less about weak Pokemon. Well, that's not very nice, man. I mean, come on. I mean, well, anyway, he, he he's a total jerk. He, he's a moron, so I guess there's nothing you can do about him. Anyway, that, that's about it for this part, guys. Um, Rate, comment, subscribe, guys. I uh, hope you liked my video. Alright, see you guys.